Using the simple form inputs in Jump Chart, you can create a form right in line with your content. Let's create a sample form together. Ready? OK, start off in edit mode on your content page. We'll type name and then head up to the toolbar. From the bracket icon dropdown, you'll see all kinds of form input options. For this one, we'll choose input. We'll do an email address field the same way. See what it looks like when you save and close? Next, let's ask customers to opt in or out. Use the radio option from the bracket dropdown this time. Use this if you want only one option to be selected at a time. Use the checkboxes if you want multiple items available to select. See? Like this. Want to allow people to select from a dropdown of options? Sure thing. Use the File Select option for that. Just replace the default content jump chart formats for you with your own. The form is coming together. Let's keep going. If you want people to be able to upload a file, use the File Select option from the dropdown. If you're creating a login page, there's a special input field you can use just for passwords. Want a bigger area to type in? No problem. Use the text area option for that. And finally, give your customers a button to send in their information by selecting Submit from the bracket dropdown. You can even customize what the button says with some simple text formatting, like this. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions on how to create a form in your project, shoot a note over to support at jumpchart.com.